Many people here in Indy know about that bop to the top. Oh, I yeah. think that's so fun to say. Every year, Hoosiers run up the stairs of the One America Tower in an effort to raise money for Riley's Children's Foundation. I have done this. It's a killer workout, and it's such a great experience. And, of course, despite the pandemic, the event is still happening. But this year, it's virtual. Our Randall Newsom has more. Hey everybody, I'm coming to you from the newsroom to talk about this year's Bop to the Top run, and I'm here with Don Carr. How are you doing, sir? I'm doing great, Randall. Thanks for having me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thanks for having us. Okay, so this year's Bop to the Top is obviously different. I kind of shared that with folks, how things are different this year. Well, uh, believe it or not, this is the 38th annual for the event, which uh, we've done 37 years uh, down at the One America Tower building, and this is the first year we've had to go virtual for the obvious reasons. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do it virtually this year. We're hoping people will still sign up. You'll still get a T-shirt, and we just ask that people uh, they go onto our website, sign up, do the event. And the nice thing is, this event will help raise a really good cause for Riley Hospital Foundation. When you think of that cause, uh, what makes that cause special to you? You've been a part of this for now three decades. What what makes this special to you still? Yeah, Riley's Children's uh, Foundation, they do such good for um, uh, for the families, basically, that are associated with Riley's Children's Hospital. Obviously, it's it's for children, so families have to come in, support them, and they, they provide a lot of the money and support for families that come in. Uh, the things they do are wonderful. We've been associated with them for 35 years now, and it's just a good relationship we have with them. So great cause. Um, it's a good event. A great uh, something to do in the winter time, so works well for everyone. Now you talk about the event that that that's a lot of stairs, Donna. <laughs> do you feel like uh, are you are you going to get involved this year? You, you going to run to the top? Because I'm you thinking know, about I, it. What do you know, think? Yeah, every you know, every year I do the event, so this mm -hmm. year it's different. That we just ask people to go out uh, on their own, either go find a parking garage or do something, or go out and just even if you just go out and run 5K, you're doing something healthy. We're not going to be very picky. If you wish to submit your results online, we'll post them for you, but you're not required to do that. So we're hoping people can do that. It's for the entire month of February. So okay. if you want to do steps every single day and submit how many steps you've done over the entire month of February, that's just a fun challenge for people to do. And people compare to see how they do to other people. So it'll be interesting to see at the end of February how people have done for this event. But yeah, I'm going to get out. I get out. I ran this morning some, and I try to do a few stairs where I can. Obviously, some people have an advantage of being around maybe a um, you know, some steps that they can do uh, while socially distancing. We don't want people to go inside actually public buildings and do it, mm -hmm. but uh, they can be creative and do their own thing. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. So um, for you, uh, what do you feel like uh, should inspire people to still be a part despite all the changes? Uh, what, what would you say to those people? Well, the nice thing is, like I said, you have the entire month. We've, we've, we've made this virtual so you don't have to show up on one single day and do it. You can do it anytime during the month of February. And like I said, if you do it, there is an entry fee. Part of that fee goes to Riley's Children's Hospital. And also you can raise, as be a fundraiser, you can raise additional funds, which many people do that. So take some time during the month of February, sign up. You'll get a nice long sleeve shirt for showing that you've done it, uh, which is a nice bonus. We will mail that to you at the end of the month. So we just ask that people sign up and get that, uh, get the registration in. What does it mean to you? Um... 30 plus years you guys have been a part of this event. Uh, what does it mean to still be able to keep it going? Well, what it means is uh, right now about $800,000 that we've raised over all these years for Riley's uh, Children's Foundation, which is a big number, but it adds up year after year. So we want to keep it going, even though we're restricted this year for obvious reasons, we want to keep that momentum going, raise some good money for Riley's Children's Foundation. It's a great cause. Awesome, guys. A great cause indeed. Yeah. Don, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and start warming up. You said all month, right? So I can go ahead and start. I'm going to go you ahead and start warming up. I'm, 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 I'm going to try to get ready. I'm <laughs> starting now. And hopefully I'll have something for you by the end of the month. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> all right, guys. Don Carr with Tuxedo Brothers Event Management. Thank you so much for having us, man. Thank you. All right, guys. Find out more about this Bop to the Top run on our website, wishtv.com. I'll send Bye. it back to you, ladies. Bye.